For the second year in a row, VA hospitals outperformed non-VA hospitals in two major nationwide reviews for care, quality, and patient satisfaction. Joining us with more is Dr. Sharif El Nahal, Undersecretary for Health at the Veterans Health Administration in the Department of Veterans Affairs. Why is VA care the best choice for veterans? Well, thanks so much for having me. You know, I think the main reason that VA performs so well for veteran care is our workforce. About a third of our workforce are veterans themselves. And so many more have a veteran in their family or close to them, a parent, a sibling, a son or a daughter. And so they really take the mission personally. Another really important reason also is that we train about 70% of every physician who graduates from medical school and a training program in the country. Country. And a lot of these clinicians at the top of their game see VA as a great place to work. And so we have an incredible mission, Claudia. And part of that means getting the best workforce in who's performed so well on these ratings. So what does this data say about VA care? Well, the data directly compares VA medical centers to non-VA medical centers on quality and patient safety outcomes, but also patient experience. And on this scale, 58% of VA medical centers score four or five stars on the overall hospital quality star rating, and 79% of VA medical centers score four or five stars on the patient experience star rating, compared to only about 40% of private sector institutions. And we're really proud to announce that the Louisville VA Medical Center is one of the four-star medical centers across the country, which means it's not only one of the best in VA, it's one of the best medical centers across the United States, which we're really proud to announce for the veterans in the area. And what are some ways that VA achieves and maintains those high quality of care for veterans? Well, like I said, part of it's recruiting the best healthcare workforce in the country. Uh, we, in 2023, we hired more than 61,000 new healthcare workers into the system to prepare for a historic expansion of veterans' benefits and care under the PACT Act, which President Biden signed in August of 2022. And we also have a lot of programming and focus on patient safety. We have one of the leading national centers for patient safety in the country. And we really look at not just the medical decisions that are made, but also how they are followed through and how veterans are cared for across their care trajectory. And I think those are the reasons why you're seeing these excellent ratings. And why does the VA feel it's so important to share this data again this year? We want veterans to be empowered with a choice, knowing that they've earned this really important care that they're getting. And so right now they can go to CMS Care Compare and just type in their zip code or their location, and they'll see VA medical centers nearby compared apples to apples with non-VA medical centers so that they can make an informed decision. And I think in most areas of the country, they'll find that VA medical centers are just as good in many places better than the alternative, and that's what they deserve. And what would you say to those veterans who do not use the VA for their care? Yeah, my humble request to any veteran watching or listening is to try us out. Go to va.gov slash PACT. We are not the old VA. We are inviting as many new veterans into the system as possible. And hopefully these star ratings and our data overall, but also our workforce and our people uh, can convince you to try to get care with us. And we hope to be able to provide the best care possible because, again, that is what you deserve and what you have earned. Dr. Elna Hall, thank you so much. Thank you.